Paralysis Solutions seem to be on a crest of a wave at the moment. You're very pleased with your progress. Yeah, we're really delighted because we think we're, uh, <coughs> well, we probably are the largest social enterprise in Thurrock, which we're very really happy about. And we're very keen to support disabled people to live the lives of their choice. That's why something like the Tea Fest is important to us to say, hey, we're here, we're included, we're part of this community. You're a social enterprise. Can you explain a little bit about that and how it works for you? Right. What that means is we operate exactly like a business, but any profits that we make go back into the community. So we're a community interest company. And do you have, politically, do you have to sort of walk a narrow path because of things like, you know, disability, you know with, with questions about welfare reform? Is that quite difficult for you? It can be, but the reality is obviously we're non-political, but the reality is we understand that people have rights and we understand how supportive the local members can be in ensuring that those rights are met. And what, what support do you get from Thurrock Council? We actually get quite a lot of support. Currently Thurrock Council has me um, on secondment, so therefore they're paying my wages, which is fantastic. That supports the company and that's very good. The reality is as well that the council are looking at a single tender process to hand over their provider services to us. So that's a lot of support. And on a personal level, people like Sonny, for example, yes, you've yeah. done a hell of a lot for Sonny, haven't yeah. you? Oh, I think Sonny's done a lot for himself, bless him. I think he's a very capable young man. He's very keen, he's very community spirited. It's about the thing that disables people most is other people's attitude. And with Sonny, people shift their attitude with him and he just grows and bees himself. So the old term, does he take sugar? Have we come a long way from that? I'd like to think we have, but the truth is that there are some people who still talk to disabled people as though they're stupid, yeah. And so this weekend being here at TFES, what do you hope you hope to get out of it, so to speak? Well, we're doing it in partnership. We're using the Transvol vehicle because it's got electricity and comforts like that and it's accessible. We're here with Batias and it's about coming together as different community groups saying we're here and we're part of this community. Already we've got lots of people coming up to us and showing interest in what we're doing and wanting to volunteer, which is fantastic, all part of the big society. But also we're doing surveys here of the local residents to ask them what they think as part of the Thurrock Coalition. What, what do you think about the services locally? What do you think people will need or want?